All right, today I'm gonna do a Chronicles rip. This is football, this is not draft, although it looks so darn similar. I have to like read super carefully when I'm trying to pick this up in the store. Uh, I got a couple different things here. I got some fat packs, uh, value packs or hanger. I, these are hanger packs. And then this is like a fat pack, I guess. So this is in in place of a hanger box, I think. I am i don't understand the difference, to be honest. But uh, these ones are 30 cards, these ones are 15. Then we have three blasters as well. So we'll start off with these little guys. This is, I think these were 10 or no, $7 each or something like that. And whoops, I ripped it so you can't see the the pay the pay odds here. I'll flip this one open so you can see. Here's the potential pulls that you can get on these ones. So numbered to 199, numbered one ones for some of them. I wonder what's different than between these two. For the sake of oh, science, as I'm ripping the packs open, instead of trying to show you what I'm trying to show you here. These are the differences between the two. Does that help you guys? You can go ahead and screenshot that if you want. 99, 99, 399. Looks like the same odds, honestly. Just the difference is the Hanger exclusive versus the Pinnacle insert. So Pinnacle is in the uh, Hanger or the Fat Packs. The Hanger Packs have Stars and Stripes. So anyway, let's go ahead and get into it. Uh, the uh, Blasters have Prestige Rookies. So hopefully we'll get some little hits here. I do like Chronicles. It's a fun rip. Lots of value for getting players at least. Although they might not be the most valuable cards. Uh, at least it's a fun rip because you get to see, there's a Mac Jones, Gridiron Kings. You get to see some of the players that you want to see and you get them pretty often. They don't work much though. So there's a Jamar Chase as well. That's kind of a cool, like a gold or chrome. What is that? Yeah, I don't know what it is, but that's that's cool. That's a nice little chrome-ish sort of uh, vibe. Then these are the two pinnacles. Those look pretty dated. And then we have uh, Rookies Sam right there in the Legacy style. Uh, I'll do those three first and then we'll get on to the other. Looks like we got a um, acetate in this one, at least in the back. But what do you guys think about Chronicles? Is it something you guys like or not? I think there's a Fields base. I think that it's one that it's fun to just, again, see lots of your players that you're chasing. Um, and if you don't hit them on prism or anything else i mean you'll get them for sure in this as you can see there's there's usually a ton so this is the difference so you can see the difference in the gold and the regular foil i was wondering and then here's the pinnacles Favre and travis and then we got a jc horn in the back for the playoff acetate and the last value pack again these are like seven bucks the other hanger packs though are 15 so those are significantly more, so keep that in consideration. They're half, I mean, they're half, these are half the price, roughly. Um, depending on we can, if you can get them that. There's Bateman, a couple of rookies. Another one of these. We have Zach Wilson. Those are kind of nice. Ian. And there's a, the gold. There's a Pinnacle, Josh Berry, and then Rondell Moore. For the Cardinals. All right, now we're getting into these hangers. If I already ripped this one open, so the hangers. It's like it's San Francisco in the back there. So this is twice the amount of cars as a tray. And then we'll get into the uh, the blasters. But again, value rip. Get lots of stuff here. Um, just not worth a ton unless you get some random numbered stuff. Which honestly, there's a nice. Well, that's cool looking. There's a score insert. That's not numbered, but that's fire. I'll put that one up here just because it's kind of a fun. Maybe I should maybe I should sleeve it. It's probably not worth anything, but still a cool looking score insert and silver. And then we get into the uh hanger pack exclusive. So the Antonio Gibbs, Aaron Rodgers, Chubb, AJ, Jerry Lance. There's a Trey Lance in the silver there. A.J. Brown. 
That's nice. A Zach Wilson in the color match. It's the green parallel. Take that. Not bad at all. That's probably worth a couple bucks. Just not too many, but a couple. I will definitely take it though. There's another Zachy Wilson little baby face there. From all the never mind. I was gonna say all the baby milk, but probably not necessary. Uh Mr. Trashk. There's Gainwell. There's Waddle. There's Ian Book in the acetate. And then we got a Trey Lance. Nice. And this is the magnitude. Um, insert. I thought this was magnitude was um, exclusive to these, but maybe not. I oh, know it just says look for rookie cards in the new new forms of magnitude tray as well. I'll put him behind the score one. Oops, kind of like the score one better just because it's silver. All right, so two decent little hits there off that first hanger. Hangers aren't bad, man. Fifteen cards, or I mean thirty cards. And um, quite a few inserts back here. There's Jamar Chase, base rookie. Tua, Devontae, Carr. I don't, the rookies are kind of mixed in with uh, the Chronicles base. There's Eli. All right, here's Tyreek Hill. There is Patty Mahomes again. I think I've seen that one before. Kamara, there's a Jamar Chase rookie, nice. Kyle Pitts in the Flux. Lamar Jackson. Najee Harris in the Green. Nice to see that. Eddie and Trey Lance in the Luminance. Franks, Falcons. I haven't seen any numbered cards or anything yet, but if I miss one, uh, let me know because they are really easy to miss. All right, looks like we got a Fields back here too. So there's a Kenne and then a Moore. We got Fields, Magnitude, and then a Jabbar Chase uh, for the clear vision. And some of the hobby ones have these like numbered, but they look literally exactly the same. So it's kind of kind of cool, but also kind of like uh, less impactful because you get a bazillion of the base ones and then only a couple of them with the numbers on them. And literally the cereal is the only thing that separates them. So it is what it is. Looks like another tray on the back there. All right, we'll get through this one. Speaking of Trey, there's another one. So I'm just putting like top rookies here in a sense and then uh, other inserts and rookies right over here. And then the bulk on the other side over here. Aaron Jones, Tyreek, and here are the exclusives out of the hangar. So there's Kyle Murray, Waller, there's Trey Lance. Nice, Aaron Jones. There is a Javante, and this is a silver, but not, or that's just the base, not the actual silver, like the Trey Lance one was. The Trey Lance one's nice. Jones, Chuba in the green. We got Waddle in the base. Stevenson, Parsons, Dance Marshall, Mills, Javante. J.C. Horn, we got the Mac Jones momentum, and then the Trey Lance, nice. So we got a lot of these ones, and uh, there's a, a Mac attack right there. So that's the last four. Those ones, I'll put these over to the side. And let's get into these, uh, these blasters back here. So we got three blasters. Ron, I think these are 25 each. You get them at Walmart, they're like 28. So prices are ours. Kind of like that. Here's a look at the, the pay on the back. Some more options out of the blaster. Prestige rookies, pink parallels, and then flux and magnitudes is potential things you can get. Alright, I'll go ahead and open all three of these real quick. So far, so good, though the five packs or the hanger packs or whatever did okay. Hopefully, we'll get a couple more things. I'll put these back here 
for when we do. All right, so we've got three more boxes here. If you guys are interested in buying some Chronicles, I'll link them in the description. And you can go find your own boxes and check those out if you guys are interested. So Ramon Stevenson, this is Prestige. Greg in the Playoff Momentum and then a Michael Carter and Raji Harris in the pink. Take that. Sometimes the parallels aren't that exciting. Just pink print instead of, let's say, just the silver. But, um, but you see I got a Najee in pink, Zach in green. Here's a Mac Jones base. Take that. Big Ben. There's Najee score. So that one was not exclusive to the, the hangers. I thought it was. And then we have a Fields and a Kirk in the pink. The pinks are the Blast exclusive. It says there's like eight of them, so something like that. So you get quite a few of them. And a Waddle base. So nice we're getting a lot of the base um, rookies. Let's see here. Devonta Smith. There's another Waddle. I think we got all of the magnitudes now, almost. Kellen Mond, and then Kellen Mond, pink. Oh, we got silver. Oh, it's, who's that? Let's take a look and see here. They slide around quite a bit when you get to them. Ridley, and then, ooh, nice, silver. Trevor Lawrence, I'll take that. Marquise Brown, and then uh, Davis, David Mills for that. This is nice, silver. Um, what was it? Diagon? I don't know of this specific insert, but nice little silver. Trevor Lawrence on that. Moving on. Got a prism one in here. Oh, we'll go right to it. Looks like Najee. Kind of ruined it, but it's hard because they slip around so much. Nice little Naj there. Prism. Will you make your money back? I mean, you'll get a lot of, I mean, you could ask that with any product. It's the wrong question to ask. We'll start there. But, uh, I mean, you can, obviously, if you get lucky. But a lot of these hits are obviously not super amazing. Um, they're, they're fun. They're just not worth a ton. And if they're worth a good amount now, that doesn't mean they're going to be worth a, a good amount after the football season. Uh, because you never know. Like, some of the, the prized... People that everybody's collecting might not do, perform, and then they might do terrible, and so you just never know. There's Jamar, Miles, and so, and that's, that was the first one. I'll go into the second one now. So yeah, I mean, really, it's not the right question to ask, but can you get some good things from Chronicles, even though they're available everywhere? Yeah, there's numbered cards. There's things that you can get that, uh, that are hard to pull, and if you're lucky enough to get some of those, then you're in a good spot. The, um, there's a couple more here. The hobby side obviously has way better pulls and way better options for numbered cards, but hobby side's obviously a lot more difficult to get hits on. So that is what it is. And then we got a magnitude. Is this a Herbert? So hard to hope to get them off there. There's a Herbert second year and the Devonta Smith. So far, pretty average. Got a couple of good hits here and there. The Trevor is nice. The Najee was nice out of the first. Um, and we got Horn and we got Stevenson, Matt and Sam. Matt and Sam. Seems like that should be a TV show name. Matt and Sam. Oh, we got points. What the world? What the heck? That is surprising. I don't know why they gave points, but I will happily take those. Because um, there's not guaranteed autos in here. So maybe that means I could have had something cool and I totally did not get it now. Chuba. That's unfortunate. It makes me kind of wish that I got whatever was coming instead. But it's only 400. That's the same. Just put this in perspective. That's the same amount of points that I got from... Prism first off the line hobby box. Like, that was the 
craziest thing ever. Oh man, that's a, that's a cool insert, but not the guy I want. Um, here's a Mac Jones. That is Prestige, and this is Rashad Bateman Silver. It's kind of cool. Hmm, maybe I put him over here. And then Dylan and Anthony. But yeah, that's uh, that's interesting. I wonder why they gave uh, points. So far, that's the best thing that I got. So maybe that's why. But DK, there's another Zach Wilson right here, and that's just the base one. Though no silver, Calvin. Is it Alvin? Did I say Cal I keep I call him Calvin. Alvin. All right, <laughs> a couple more. And uh, Panini points. I have a good amount of them, like a couple thousand now. I just am waiting to use them on something, a sparkle pack or something, if I can ever see them pop up. So hopefully that will happen eventually. There's Tylen Wallace. Oh, what do we have backwards here? Why is this backwards? I'm totally lost. There is Adam and I'm not sure what happened here. Run on more. No numbers. Just a goof up? Or did I goof this up? Was this one? Yeah, no numbers. I don't know why that was backwards. Somebody help me out. If you guys saw something that I didn't. Oops. Because I have no idea why that was backwards. Anytime stuff is backwards like that, it definitely usually means there's like a variation or an uh, auto. Let's see what? Another one. Why is this one backwards? Well, I'm confused. There's Travis, Marshall, and then this one's backwards too. Magnitude, Najee. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe they're just messing with the... Maybe this is the way it's supposed to be. The acetates are supposed to be backwards for the sake of the cards, but only select packs get the treatment they deserve. There's a Pitts. There's another one. So weird. Patrick and then Patty. Very, very odd. You get a lot of bulk stuff in here, but it's, again, a fun rip just to see all the different sets and see the different cards for the individual, play Oops. individual players that you like. So it's a fun one. It's not one that you're you're trying to make a bunch of money on, um, usually, but that's most sets. There's a Zach Wilson again. Huh. That's so weird that they're all backwards this time. There's a Kenny. There's a Wilson in green. That's I'm green because it's supposed to be. And then there's a sports. That's very weird. Anyway, kind of uh kind of fun. Hopefully you guys enjoy the rip. No, there's a Mac Jones Silver. Oh, we'll take that. Look at that. Travis, Trevor, Trevor back there. He was like trying to hold it down, but Mac came, came in for the snake and got him. That's nice. I mean, at least we get some silver action there. Just a couple of those, a couple of bases, and then that one, and then the last pack, and then I'll show you the recap of all the acetates and stuff that I got for the top. Top players at least. Is that Trey? Did I get a Trace? Prism? Kyle. Well, Kyle. That's all right. We'll take it. I like Kyle too, right? Hopefully he'll be good because I've got a lot of his cards. And there we go. This is Trevor Lawrence. I don't think I, if I didn't get that one, now I have it. So lots of base, lots of additional inserts for rookies and stuff. So, I mean, tons and tons of stuff here. And that was just one of the stacks. There's two of those stacks. And then this is one. Of the, this is a stack from just the uh, the retail side of the the blasters. Trevor Lawrence. There's a Zach. There's a Najee. Zach again. Rashid Bateman. There's a Mac. Zach. Justin. Jamar. Oops. Something behind here. There's acetate. Trey. I'm just trying to do that thing. And then we have the base here in the fields and a Najee silver, or not or not silver, just a base. There's a Mac, and then we have the Najee in the pink. So that's the way that that one went down. And then we also did get Mac in the momentum playoff. Trey Lance, Acetate, Waddle, Trey, I like that one, that one. 
and then Justin, Jamar, Lance, and then Najee in that um, playoff in the green. That one's nice. I should probably sleeve that one too. Green. Jamar, Jamar, Waddle, Mac, Zach, Zach, Lance, and company back here. So that's, uh, that's a look at those ones. Not a bad lot of inserts. I'll sleeve some of them up for fun, especially the acetate ones. This just scratch up pretty easily. I think some of the best ones that I got, though, are back here. And just because of the color match. But we got the tray. The magnitude, okay, but we got the tray and the silver score. We got the Zach in, what is this one? Luminance. Nice in the green, too. Color match. Trevor Lawrence and the Mac Jones silvers. Those are nice in the Diagons. And then we got the Naj uh, in the uh, purple, or the purple, the black and whatever, just prism, and then the 400 points. I do kind of want to look real quick. Um, at center stage and see what if these things are even listed because curious to see Max silver is like ten dollars Trey, I mean Trevor Lawrence is around six bucks or so So I think that the prices will vary. I'm sure that if they do well this year ten dollars is right 25 they could probably do well like that. This is the Zachy Let's see green. I don't see green color match the blue is numbered to 99 so a couple bucks trey lance silver it's like six a dollar six five dollars something like that it's not huge dollar numbers like i said but um and then there's the naji 17 10 3 4 7 so you get the, the picture right and then let's do this naj down here this one's kind of cool I know the green one too for that looks nice so that's kind of a look at the uh, the product i like it i mean it's fun it's fun to rip basketball i enjoy as well but uh there's lots of fun acetate stuff if you're looking uh, for that but all in all a pretty fun rip thanks for watching hopefully you guys enjoyed hopefully we'll see you back for some more videos uh version. all right peace guys